Hello. Hey. How's everyone doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, welcome to a rare crossover between my weekday and weekend streams, because everyone was enjoying Eve um, on Thursday. Everyone wanted more, so we're playing a bit more today. Um, not too much, because I know we are uh, a little bit, I guess, in crossover mode between the weekday and weekend streams. I don't want to throw people off too much. Um, and also, I'm a, I'm a little tired. I'm a little tired, just a little bit. Um, I somehow did too much and also too little last night at the same time, <laughs> which is weird. Um, I don't know what the fuck happened, like, last night. I, I think I, like, disassociated or something. But, yeah. Um, it's gonna be a, uh, I think a two-hour stream. I'm gonna play a bit of this and then maybe, uh, a bit of something else. I'm not sure. I'll see how I'm feeling. Uh, but yeah, Eep. I'm excited to, uh, get back into this. I am this, just like with you, Maniki, this game has not left my consciousness since I last streamed it on Thursday. Um, so, Yeah. Um, how's everyone doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, we've got Mantis, we got Anna, we got Japoleon, we got Photon. We have Split Gear, what's up? How you doing? Uh, we have Deadhead Ryan, Toph, what's up? Good to see ya. Um, Anna, of course, Have Abbott. Um, and everyone, that's everyone so far. So, yeah, what's up, Limit? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Uh... Let me just get something set up here. I think I forgot to turn on my sound alerts, even though we are going to keep them a little bit quiet for Eve because it is um, a game that deserves atmospheric immersion, I would say, <laughs> which is why my voice is a little quieter today. That recap is completely wrong. Give me one second. I need to, I need to change that. <laughs> uh... Just let me write the uh, the recap here. Yeah, we're playing, we're playing, uh, we're playing Yakuza and Eve. Yeah. Uh, let me just type this up. We helped. We helped Gary after he lost his rose, his blue rose. And now we're exploring the quote unquote museum together. There we go. Recap is updated. There we go. Sorry about that. That's the one thing I forgot to do last before the uh, the stream here. So yeah, um, you're playing Cabaret Club in, in uh, Yakuza 2. I, I need to do that this week, Japoleon. That's what I'm doing. Um, there we go. Last time on Eve, we fell into a painting of the deep sea. Our rose is giving us life while paintings are attacking us, attacking us for some reason. We helped Gary after he lost his blue rose, and now we're exploring the museum together. Yeah, we met Gary last time. We're going to uh, get a lot more Gary dialogue today. I'm sure some people are excited for that. Hopefully most of you are. I'm excited for that, too. <laughs> All right, let me uh, get this booted up here. Oh, by the way, happy uh, 10 years before I do start here. Happy 10 years to this one post on DeviantArt. Is it this one? Yeah, this one, <laughs> this one right here. Yeah, happy 10 years to this. God, I wish that was me. Were me, rather. God. 10 years ago. I wonder how this guy's doing. Holy shit. <laughs> Best post, yeah. I'm not going to post the original uh, context because it's kind of cursed. But irrespective of that, he was absolutely spitting facts. Absolutely. And uh, let's go ahead and boot this up here. Let's see. You think that dude finally got to suck the titty? Yeah? <laughs> you think so? Oh my god. Alright. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh, let me see if this is set up. Yes, hello, I am here. Hi. I don't have a wave, but I am here indeed. Uh, yeah, there, there is a context. Yeah, Mantis. I'm not going to mention too much more of it, but it is related to uh, what Split Gear said. <laughs> yeah, it, it, is, <laughs> it is unfortunately related. <laughs> I'm not making a taunted command. No, I'm not. I'm not protector. What's up? How you doing? All right. Let's uh, let's play some Eve here. Let's go. Let's do it. But yeah, hope everyone's doing well. Uh, 
I went to get some more uh, plates, actually, some more homewares for my home, because it's fall, you know. I uh, I was kind of feeling like I, first of all, I don't have enough plates and like pots and not not pots, like plates and like bowls and stuff like that. Um, which I I do kind of want more since I'm like running the the dishwasher now. There's a lot of room for stuff there. I also got an apron. If you didn't see this on Twitter. I have a rare picture of my body. <laughs> it still feels, feels weird to like perceive myself in a photograph, but apron. That's that's me over there. Apron acquired. Yeah, it's uh it's fall themed actually. I want like a duck one. Um, but this one is actually pretty good. It fits the theme, the uh the plate and whatnot. I like it. No money shift. What's up? How you doing? Welcome. Thanks for the follow. Thank you. Nice apron. You guys got a good shot of my, like, beard hair, which I- I fucking hate facial hair, by the way. I'll say this right now, I wish I could just get rid of it, which I probably can. Um, but it will cost money, and I don't know if I exactly want to do that, per se. But, yeah, facial hair sucks. I just chop this fucking thing off, like, t twice a week, it sucks. <laughs> you went to h Mart today and got noodles and red bean buns? Yo, let's go. Let's go, Toph. You have facial hair? I personally I don't like my facial hair. That's that's the uh that's a clarification right there. I'd have to do electrolysis for a long time, yeah. Yeah. You might go to HR tomorrow, Anna? Oh hell yeah. Um what's 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 good at HR that I seen recently? The H Mart's here have like prepared foods which are pretty good. Like little little boxes of food. Um I like drinking sweat, Picari sweat specifically. That's sometimes at age mart. <laughs> it's something it's something I got from Taiwan and I've liked it ever since. Anything lychee, Anna. If you see like a lychee drink. L-Y-C-H-E-E. -E, try some lychee drinks. Anyone who hasn't uh, had any lychee before. It's uh, one of my favorite fruits that I can't get easily, unfortunately. All right. Let's go here. Drink sweat. It's it's called Picari sweat split gear. Um, it's it's basically like a, a sports drink. It's the the best way I could describe it is like it's sweet water, which doesn't sound like really appetizing, but it it somehow works. It's like sweet with a little bit of like a fruity taste. This right here. It's, it's a very bizarre drink, but I like it. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why, honestly. It's not carbonated. It's just, like, sweet water. There's no carbonation. It's flat. I don't know. I'm just weird like that. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I think the volume should be at the same level as last time. Uh, so things should be okay. Just let me know if things start sounding kind of weird. Of course. Uh, but yeah, let's go. Let's do it. So say hello to Gary. Hmm, should we move forward? I don't think there's anything left for us here. Uh, this refill? Oh, I guess we can do that, sure. Let me save again here. You're trying to get a wizard beard? Yo. I've been thinking about doing a uh, Movember for charity. Which is where you, like, you don't shave, basically. Or you try to... It's either way you don't shave and or you like try to grow like a, a good mustache in the week of November. The week of November? The month of November. What the fuck? <laughs> nice brain moment there. The week of November. I don't really care a split gear. Like, like it's just personal preference. I'm fine with facial hair, but... If it's if it's going to a good cause, then I'm I'm totally okay doing it. Totally. It is totally okay. Hey Bun Time, what's up? How you doing? Good to see ya. Sometimes months really do feel like weeks, yeah. Scarf, what's up? How you doing? Welcome. A headless statue. Okay, this thing didn't actually like end up killing us, which is good. November has been condensed to a single week. Yeah, unfortunately, the week includes Black Friday. <laughs> That's probably what would be the case there. 
<laughs> all right. Oh, what is this? Okay, this is all new stuff now. So let's see. Once again, I am going to focus on um, the atmosphere of this game as we should for games like this. Uh, this is like a, a marriage thing, looks like. They don't look very happy to be in these marriage portraits, I guess. <laughs> uh, bride's right hand. Bride's left hand. So it's both the bride, huh? Grieving bride. Grieving groom. Oh, shit. Man married himself wearing a veil. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> Grieving, but they're dressed in such celebratory clothes. Is that a cat? What the heck is this? <laughs> it's a big fucking cat. It reminds me of those little blob things from Cave Story. That are like in the in the uh, in Grass Town. It's a big chonker. Something strange is blocking the door. Touch, observe, have Gary move it, <laughs> or do nothing. <laughs> I mean, Gary could probably move it. He seems pretty strong. Touch. Oh, what the heck? Ah, are you all right? I think we ought to stay away. It's like a puffer cat. Its back is slowly going up and down. It doesn't appear to be a stuffed animal. <laughs> Kabi-sama, what's up? Welcome. Oh, man. Rouge, hello, hello? Sleepy cat. Alright, Gary. Actually, no, if we touch it, like, it's gonna hurt us, right? So, hold on. Let's wait a second. Why do you suppose this frame is so low to the ground? It's for, uh, for kids to see the photos. <laughs> Listen to the teapot's demands. What is this, fucking Alice in Wonderland? Oh, I don't like that. Oh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't like that. God, what is this? Why are there eyes on the floor? Okay, if there's Igor, I'm not okay with Igor. Google. Fuck you. Shut up. I just activated my Google Assistant for some reason. I'm gonna, like, step on an eye. Just be warned. Oh, actually, I can't. But this eye is fucked up. Doesn't this one eye seem a bit bloodshot? Did I need my assistant, Igor? <laughs> I don't know. It didn't activate that time. Okay, these guys don't do anything. A painting of what looks like icebergs. A painting of a white snake. Looking closer, the eye part is sunken in. So we got press or something, I guess? That's how you're right that's why how your right eye is looking right now, Anna? Oh god. Yeah, please get new glasses or just try and uh rest the eyes a little bit, maybe. Hopefully you can. <laughs> like sometimes I just like sit back and just, you know, close my eyes. Just go like, oh. I'm good. Cause wearing glasses all the time doesn't really help your eyes out that much. Unfortunately. A painting of a coffee cup and cake. A painting of an upside down woman. Kind of upside down, more like diagonal. And she's like in some sort of like poison bath or something. It's purpley. Maybe it's a vat of, like, wine or something. I know wine's not that color, but... Okay, let's go in this room. Let's see. Okay, I'm starting to see the puzzle already. Let's see. <laughs> the sense-sensitive... What was this? Porcupus? No, that's an odd one. Why not Percupine? 
porcupus or porcupine? <laughs> Let's do porcupine. Hmm. Then we'll just go with that. It sounds cuter after all. Gertena certainly uses some odd words, though. What a wonder you need help understanding them. The sense sensitive porcupine. There we go. We just renamed the fucking. the painting right there. There's text engraved on the large teapot. Common sense dictates that teacups move in straight lines. <laughs> You're so right, Gary. I like porcupine too. Purr, purr. Meow, meow, purr. <laughs> God, I fucking remember that video. That down the rabbit hole video from uh from Frederick Knudsen also known as uh, Fat Nuts that one is so good yeah <laughs> it's, it's a trip that's that's what I would describe that video as teacups are not permitted to be picked up teacups won't stop until they bump into something we pour tea only into cups of the same color. Okay, so it's a puzzle thing. Yep. It's basically ice physics. Um, and you have to deal with that. Indeed, it does seem that there are four teapots and four cups. One in each of four colors. The EVE Online video. Yeah, I, 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 I heard like he's getting a little stressed out about that. <laughs> probably, probably because of its huge scope, you know? Which makes sense. Dude's definitely working. Oh, okay. I see how I have to do this, I think. The video is massive and confusing. Yeah, that's what I would expect with EVE Online, right? Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Let me uh, move this back. Okay, yeah, I actually fucked up. Let me uh, get out of here. Yeah. So which... I need to sort of, like, put the cups down one by one, basically. In, like, sort of a cycle, so, like, nothing gets stuck. Five hours? Oh my god, yeah. I don't know anything about EVE Online, so hopefully it's a good, uh... I'm hoping it's a good, like, there's a good, like, primer to the whole game of sorts. Although, I don't know if I can call it a game anymore. It's sort of a, an experience now. <laughs> okay, I think I, I got this, though. So, do this. And then... Uh... Move that around. Oh, shit. Uh... I almost got it, almost. Wait, no, I got it, I got it, I got it. There we go. <laughs> I'm smart. What uh, what color of drink do you guys want? You want the yellow drink, the blue drink, the red drink, or the green drink? Wonder what those all taste like. The smell of tea began to laugh through the room. You want blue flavor? Red because it's our rose? Yeah, that would make sense. A strong smelling tea. Are they all strong? <laughs> now, where have I seen this face before? The face change on the painting. It's the, uh, the big fucking cat. The porcupine. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. So this painting's like a portal, huh? It's like a little cat door. And this cat likes tea, I guess. Something's sticking out of the frame. It looks like a tail, but wait, never mind that. That strange thing in front of the door is gone. Now we can go inside. You'll take the JoJo piss tea. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Ooh, hello. <laughs> Flowers. Flowers are nice. Give me that there flower and I'll let you through. <laughs> Your flower, pretty please? Oh, uh, that sounds like a fucking bad idea. I just want it for a little bit. <laughs> oh, shit. 
That's kind of creepy. Holy fuck. Um, I'm gonna save. <laughs> this is probably a horrible idea, right? Yeah, sure. Sure, why not? You, you can have a little bit of this. Why not? Crimson, what's up? How you doing? Uh, now, hold on, Eve. Are you sure about that? I wouldn't trust this thing. <laughs> Thanks. It's so pretty. <laughs> well, chow time! Oh. <laughs> okay. Nyomp. You're gonna have to share Kagero even the Discord for sure. After this, yeah. Yeah, please do. After I finish this, I, I will engage in all the Eve content. Definitely. This song's pretty. I want to play for a little bit longer because I think Anna last time mentioned it. I have a piano now, actually, if you were not aware. It seems like a good piano song to learn. The problem is this piano is fucking massive and I don't have any space for it. I have to buy like a separate stand for it to put in the corner of my room. I tried to put it on the table next to me, but <laughs> the table is like too tall. So for me to play the piano, I'd have to like stand up. Pianos do tend to be massive. I just didn't realize I was buying a full size. That's the thing. That's like one thing I didn't pay attention to in the listing. So, there are talking artworks like that too. I don't suppose they tell us where the exit is. Like, I've been so used to my cello, cello like, me saying my cello is big, right? But pianos? No, that's a whole other beast. If you think about grand pianos and all that. The keys are weighted, yeah, Deadhead. It's an electric with weighted keys. The fuck is this? <laughs> what, what is this? Leave the room and all will be as it was. Oh, is this a puzzle again? Okay. It's a sliding puzzle, looks like. Yeah. But it's the chairs. Okay, I screwed up already. I don't know what these are, it's like... It, it kind of reminds me of like Salmonids. Like little Salmon fellas from like Splatoon. But also like a perfume bottle. I needed the weighted keys, Deadhead, because I like, I grew up with like an actual piano. Um, so it would just feel weird without. Okay, uh, puzzle time. This seems pretty safe. Uh, this reminds me of Canes of Hyrule a little bit. So, if we... If we do this... You just saw my message, feels, Yeah? You like the, uh... <laughs> you like the art? Yeah? You can DM me later, it's fine. You do? Hell yeah. Glad to hear it. I, uh... I just finished my very first commission, actually. <laughs> Speaking of Spiel. Uh, you'll, you'll probably find out once uh, Spiel shares it in some form. What exactly it is. Mirror Prism, what's up? It's spooky puzzle time, yeah. And I have completely botched this, so I'm out of here. Okay. Now, the only way to go like, past this area is through here, I'm pretty sure. So what did I screw up over here? What an outrageous amount of easels. They all seem to have the same painting on them. So is... Is that the only thing I can do? Let's see. Oh no, I can do this, actually. And then up like that. Oh, okay, I have to go the other way. Okay, okay. I got it. 
But yeah, how are you doing, Seals? Hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed the uh, the concert you went to yesterday. I think you went to a concert, right? There's something on the stool. Obtain the eye drops. Oh. Oh, so we can use the eye drops on the eye. Or maybe we can use the eye drops on Anna in chat here. <laughs> Get rid of that red eye, potentially. So the subject of the painting is with a bottle of eye drops. Not sure why you'd paint that. Why do we paint anything, really? That's the real question. Hey, you want some eye drops, cat? No? <laughs> the bloodshot eyes looking your way. Stare back. <laughs> um, Eve, what are you doing? G G. You guys like my Gary voice? I'll take suggestions on a uh, voice improvement. Whoop. There we go. Blink a few times. There we go. The eye was cured. And now it's schmoovin. <laughs> what the fuck? Hello. I guess you're going back to your snake, right? No? Where'd you go? Where the hell did it go? Why are these eyeballs in a place where it's so easy for things to get in them? Anyhow. It's a good question. Where doth the eye go? No. No, shut up, painting. Voltaire is cool, yeah. I haven't really heard of him too much, to be honest. Like, a lot of, like, real-life artists like that. It's definitely not my area of expertise. The musician, I think, Split Gear, yeah. I've definitely heard of the philosopher. <laughs> oh, what is this? He does music in stop animation, and he teaches stop motion at a university in New York. That's pretty fucking sick. Holy hell. I didn't know that. Wine sofa? I want this. I want this like chair. This is sick. A giant wine glass cut diagonally with a red cushion inside. That doesn't look very comfortable to sit on. Yeah, the, the glass is gonna like cut your fucking ass or something. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, it'd be like sitting on the edge of a waterbed. Yeah, dear God. You just like slip off. Melancholy. You're not sure how you say this word. Melancholy, huh? Well, really, who wouldn't be in this place? It's true. You want an autograph of the, uh, the vaporware person? Yo, let's go. You know, I'm starting to get the urge to stab things. And you probably, if you've, uh, if you've seen me play Yubaniki, you probably know why. This skeleton is sick. Puzzle. A colorful skeleton. These aren't real bones, surely. You always think about how Megamind said, said melancholy? Wasn't it like... I haven't seen that movie in like a year or so. Here, let me see. I want to I wanna hear how he said it. Please, please no DMCA, please. Let's see. Do I feel so melancholy? <laughs> melancholy? That's what it was? The volume is like super low. That's just a video. Melancholy. Nope, that is uh that is another movie that's definitely gonna get DMC and if I play anything from that, so never mind. Melancholy. <laughs> A 
colorful skeleton. Is this a display room for sculptures? None of these works were present at the Gartena exhibition. These could be valuable, in a sense. In a sense, are you gonna steal them? I don't know why, but this is relatable. This absolute mess of nature here. Like, if we, if we zoom in here, let me see. Let me, let me just zoom in here. If we take a quick look... Like, there's definitely roots down there. And, like, multiple faces. Like, in the top left, I see, like, a little, like, human face. In the top right, there's, like... A face with, like, a tongue coming out of it. And in the bottom right, there's, like, some sort of, like, little ghost fella. <laughs> it looks like. And even, like, those red dots are, like, faces. Hey, Split Gear, there's a reason why we have uh, tomato soup is banned in the tags. <laughs> no one's gonna be throwing tomato soup on these paintings today. <laughs> That's not happening. There's not even glass in front of these sculptures. We gotta be careful. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fun time. <laughs> yep. Okay, so that was a dead end. Uh, I don't think Soup is a red liquid that's gonna get on these art pieces. Oh no, it's not. No, absolutely not. <laughs> That was so dumb. I don't know what those people were trying to accomplish. They're just trying to get attention. Um for their unrelated like what was it like oil or something? Like I've already forgotten their cause, right? Like even after I read the article, which means they completely fucking failed. Yeah, oil protesters. Throwing soup at a Van Gogh painting. They did this they did this before too. Um with like the Mona Lisa, I'm pretty sure. The group was founded by an oil heiress or something. What the fuck? Anti-oil, so they throw soup at an oil painting. Yep, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, an oil painting, because it's the same fucking thing, right? No, it's not. You fucking idiots. Anti-oil group, but their founder was an oil heiress, so they're probably plants. Yeah, <laughs> probably. It's, it's a weird situation. That's for sure. So, do I have to do something with this fella? I guess? Probably just to make real activists look insane and weird and wrong. Yeah, never take things like that at face value. Like... There's sometimes a deeper motivation to everything. Just like how people sometimes impersonate other people to like, you know... Drag their name through the mud. Okay, so... I'm still hung up on the eye in this room that moved around. Also, like, don't fucking, like, destroy culture for your cause. That's just a generally bad idea. And, and now, mind you, they may, they may have known there's, like, glass, you know, in front of the paintings already, right? They just want to get people to, like, you know, react to the shock value of everything. Someone said it might be, like, the Winchester Mansion. The owner feels guilty about their money, but doesn't actually do anything to help the problem. Yeah. That, that seems like... That seems like a little track. Yeah. Hey, Kate, what's up? How you doing? Welcome, Kate. Oh, I was gonna send you a meme. I forgot. I'll send you one later. <laughs> hey Nico, you remember this game? Yeah, this is the remake um, of the original Eve game. So there's probably a few differences if you played the uh, the game a while back. Uh, I am kind of stuck. I don't know where I'm going here. Pineapple, what's up? How you doing? Uh, hmm. Feeling... 
He's a clever mind to come up with this stuff. This room seems pointless, but it probably isn't. Hmm. So we did the teacups. The eye went somewhere. Like I would I would think it would be in here. Like it would uh, you know, go to the snake somehow, because like the eye is sunken in. Like this is definitely something. This eye part is sunken in. The eye you gave the eye drops is staring towards the wall. Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay. There we go. I got it now. I should take some screenshots and get Rev to review the art pieces. He should play this. The wall here looks unusual. Found a secret passage. The tiny red dot. There's something at your feet. Obtain the red glass ball. Okay, so that goes into the snake. Oh. Okay, well, hold on. I need to get some uh, Gary dialogue in this tiny little room. Ugh, it's a tight squeeze. <laughs> there we go. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I can't miss any of this Gary dialogue, alright? There's writing on the back of the frame. In the skull's left hand. Okay, so the skull, which was... This guy, and there's something there. Something gleams on the skeleton's finger. A ring uh, seems to come off. The silver ring, which means we have to deliver that to the wedding, probably. Is that a dong coming out of the painting? No, it's a tail. <laughs> it's a tail, Kate. Because if we look in here... Ugh, it's a tight squeeze, Gary. <laughs> God damn it, Anna. Thank you for the resub. Thank you. <laughs> Three months in total. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. I appreciate you. Yeah, so the cat is here. Again, the sense-sensitive porcupine. Okay, so I guess we need both rings, right? Does it matter? Oh, this matters. Okay, hold on. I don't know anything about getting married, so... <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Okay, uh... So that's... The, it's the fourth finger, I think? Right? Why would this matter? I don't know. I'm kind of curious. It's definitely not the thumb. Oh, okay, yeah. So you have to do it, like, on the right finger here. There we go. Oh! Right, right. Don't ring wings on the left hand. Right. I thought these were, like, the... I, I didn't... I forgot they were the, uh... The... Both of the brides here. Okay, so the left fourth... I don't know my ring lore, yeah, I don't. There's a bouquet on the ground. There we go. Wait, who wants the fucking bouquet? Okay, they're now blessed. Good. They're happy. I'm taking the ring back. Take I'm taking it back. <laughs> Yeah, whoever's getting married next, obviously, they have to toss. But who would apply there? Um... Was there a relevant painting for that? I don't remember. You, you want the bouquet, little fella? <laughs> Does this guy want it? What a beautiful bouquet. When I look at flowers, I feel at peace. Speaking of which, wasn't there someone longing for flowers? Me? 
<laughs> you? Was it you? No? Oh, wait, hold on. Give me that there flower, and I'll let you through. <laughs> Your flower, pretty please? I can still give him the red rose, are you kidding me? There we go. <laughs> Thanks. It smells nice. <laughs> well, chow time! Give him a break, she's like nine. I mean... <laughs> I mean, e Eve fucked up the, uh, the ring place bin, right? It wasn't me. Totally. As promised, you can take this door. Be seeing ya. <laughs> that's a, that's a small door. That cat better not follow me, by the way. I love cats, but not that cat. I don't like this. <laughs> is, is this chat? Wait, no, this isn't chat. I don't have this many viewers. Never mind. <laughs> uh, let's see. I do now. It's all of these fellas now. Okay, these guys are staring in different directions. Uh... So this guy's staring forward. This guy's staring to the left. And this guy appears to have died. Hmm. Wait. The middle one is following me. I just realized. Yeah, it is. Whoa. Whoa, what in the world? Let's make your way through quickly. I think Gary's getting some claustrophobia here. What's the fear of people staring at you? What's the term for that? There's gotta be something for that, right? Or is it looking at you? Scopophobia. Scopophobia. This fear of being stared at. Oh god. Yeah, yeah, Bun's right, yeah. Whatever the fuck you got, Phobia Anna, that's another way to put it, too. Yeah, whatever the fuck I got going on. Okay, you're alive, we got another, uh, another fellow in the painting. Uh-oh, oh, uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. <laughs> oh no. Ladies in paintings? I don't trust them anymore, sorry. A painting of a woman? Be careful. I was attacked by a painting just like this. You knew that? Ah, oh, right, of course. You got my rose back from her. I'm impressed you were able to get away. Got her painting. Why are there so many of those painted ladies here? You are alive. I saw you move. A golden elephant with a lamp hanging from it. A newspaper spread out on the floor. Hello? Lady reading the newspaper. It's dark here, so it's hard to read the news. Maybe we have to amp up the light? Oh no. Okay, so we have, um... We got three ladies, but the dresses aren't exactly the same color. On these statues, it looks like. Oh, that is that is sus right there. That right there? <laughs> there are bars blocking the door. This is keeping us from getting in. Ah, but look. The bars are connected to that white cage. So you think they'll raise up if we pull on the cage? Is this mousetrap? Yeah. I still have the, um, that board game. That literally no one played. Everyone just set up the uh, the mouse trap contraption and let it rip. Charlotte, the lady gazing at emptiness. 
My, this painting has a different feel from the other painted ladies. Those creepy pushed back eyes. I prefer to keep my distance. Are you talking about sexy man clocks? What is this, everyone? This thing right here? The Guardian of Time? <laughs> Writing appeared on the dial. Give me a petal from your rose. In exchange, when you are in danger, I will save you. Uh... Sure... The deal is made. Yeah, I, I know about the, uh, the Don't Hug Me I'm Scared episode 2 clock. Unfortunately. I, I am aware. Like, who wants to fuck a clock, okay? I, I, I'll just say it, alright? <laughs> like, what's going on with that, huh? Input the four numbers hidden in the painting, then knock upon the door. Four numbers, hmm? I take it hitting in the painting means there's a hint in some painting. <laughs> GG Mars just busting out here, saying Tumblr did years ago, yes. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, we can heal, good. If you want me to go with the detail, then I can answer. Uh I think I'm good. Thanks. <laughs> I think I'm good. It didn't stop yet, especially since like there's an actual TV show of Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared Now. Right? I'm sure there's been like a resurgence, huh? I don't go on Tumblr these days. I never I've never been on Tumblr. But Yeah. Yeah, it all it all just goes around in a cycle, doesn't it? Please refrain from touching the displays. If by any chance you damage any exhibits, you will be expected to pay with your life. You don't know what "Don't Hug Me" is, but you remember everyone on your fault on Tumblr freaking out about it, either loving it or really, really hating it. It basically just like subverting childhood puppet shell. That's like a super simplified explanation. Why are there so many paintings of women here? I got the same question Gary has now. You have a box where you can put all the clock horny in and then put that out front on garbage day. Thank you, Limit. Noble boasting of gold. Ah, oh, rich fella, huh? This artist has some serious same face syndrome, yeah. I can't tell this red this red dressed lady from the other red red dressed lady. I can't. I still think these statues are gonna go, are, these statues are gonna like go after me. These statues. The hanged man again. Ah yes, this is one of the paintings in the gallery. Whoa, I don't want to scroll down. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, I see tummy. Whoa, whoa, hold on there, hold the fuck on. Your tenant must have been down bad for if that girl is, yeah. 2569? Nice. Yo. That's backwards. Well, that's 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 the right ways up. I turned my head upside down. Cause I can twist my head at a 180 degree angle, but don't tell anyone. You're not doing good, are you? I don't think so. Yeah, I'll just let him uh, hang out. Did you, like, did you draw his ribs too? Hold on. Yeah, I see his fucking ribs, Jesus. <laughs> okay. I, I don't trust anything here. Red clothed step.
damn your arms lady holy fuck damn what is this there's something there's something on the ground obtain the ball with hole that's a uh, not a dress color that's like the other ones holy fuck <laughs> Jesus Okay, I'm gonna save. <laughs> okay. Ho hold on. I need to- I need to calm the fuck down for a second. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, man. That got me. That got me, again. This game is getting me more than, like, any other horror thing I've played. Even in fucking Alien Isolation, which is more atmospheric, I know. But... But this is atmospheric, too. Okay. It's the atmosphere, yeah, it's the atmosphere that's contributing to this. Yeah. Hello? A mannequin head. The lady gazing at emptiness. Okay, so we have a number. Where where is this lady? Can you don't? Opossum, what's up? How you doing? Playing a spook game? Absolutely. I just got my ass scared off. Just like a second ago. That word because the pacing of this is really good. Like, there's a lot of things you, like, think about, right? But then, like, boom, suddenly. Something gets ya. Uh. You, you good? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> um. Uh. Oh, yeah. Alright. Just, just keep doing that, alright? That's alright. Are you just completely stuck? Oh no, there we go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll let, you, I'll let you jam out, God. It seems the door unlocked. She's doing her best, yeah. She is. She's building up like speed. Yeah, she, she's trying to like build up like negative velocity. Scarf, so he can, she can, like, go into a parallel dimension. <laughs> There's something in front of the mirror. Obtain the golden fish. What's this? A model of a fish? It has a horn-like protrusion. Ah, that strange ball we picked up would fit perfectly on it. Combine the golden fish and the ball with hole. Obtain the golden lamp. Oh, whoa, it's bright. So, the ball was a light bulb. Oh, hey. Wow, Gary's tall. What's this written on the mirror? A fragment of the fish is by the yellow lady. She's smaller than the original. Yeah. He's an adult. Yeah, he is. He's adult sized. A fragment of the fish. Could this be referring to the light bulb we attached to it? In that case, well, we already found it. Yo, E's kinda got drip. <laughs> Those shoes, though? I like them. Meanwhile, Gary looks like he's, uh, you know... He's got some hand-me-downs a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, what the fuck was that?! Ah! But what is that? You... Why you... Quickly close your eyes or stop Gary. Uh, hmm. Oh, 
all right, Eeb. My, that was immature of me. Well, let's go. Don't hurt the fella. Just saying hello, yeah. Also, yeah, he's probably gonna break his toes on that. I don't know, like, how dense that, uh, that face is. Say, what do you have there? A brightly shining lamp? Would you trade me for that elephant? Uh, sure. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Then the elephant's yours. Yo, we got an elephant now? Let's go. That's a good trade. Ah, it's bright. How wonderful. A large golden elephant model. Doesn't seem to be real gold. Unfortunately. Damn. But that should be enough to weigh this down, right? Yeah, hello. Just keep crawling, whatever. Wonderful days. The gallery is like a spooky amusement park with lots of peculiar things. It's so much fun playing here, the day's over before you know it. Isn't it a fantastic place? Why don't you join me here? You'll never be lonely with all this company. <laughs> yeah? Company, you say? You mean all these the fucking faces out here? Yeah? No two ways about it. This isn't gonna fit. Oh. Okay, well, I guess not. Uh, hmm. Hi. A anyone want an elephant? Who, who wants an elephant? Ah, hold on. That golden elephant! How big and beautiful! Would you trade it for me for this golden bird? Well then, shall we just put the elephant here? And taking this bird, the trade's complete. Ah, oh, thank you. What a big and beautiful golden elephant! It's not made of real gold, but sure. <laughs> He seems fond of it at any rate. I suppose that's fine then. Your mom want that elephant? You know what I want to get, everyone? I want to get like glass duck sculptures. And just like, have like, a shelf of ducks. The duck shelf, yeah. I already have a few like, Glass ducks, like, uh... Let me see if we can find them, hold on. Give me a second. Are the ducks? Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna have to take a picture of these, but hold on. I think I shared these a while back, but... Let's see here. I gotta be really careful with these ducks. I have to be super careful, and there's a good reason for that, too. Let's see. Take a photo. Get rid of that, uh, that crumb that's there. Don't want chat seeing that. <laughs> the random table crumb. Can I focus properly with this? I don't know. Things are like too small. Okay, that's pretty good. So let me, uh, let me send this to myself here. It's like the atmosphere. Let's do, let's everyone do it for Halloween. Any plans? You know what my plan is? To, uh, I don't know. 
Eat some fucking candy? I'm gonna bake something, probably. Something spooky. No, yeah. Yeah, Halloween isn't, like... <laughs> There's, like, a few things you do for Halloween, right? It's, like, the... It's not, like, the most creative holiday. Aside from, like, the costume making, right? Like, it's either you, like, you go to, like, a party, which isn't my scene. You eat candy, or you do nothing, if you're an adult. If you're a kid, you go trick-or-treating, obviously. I want to see if I can, like, volunteer somewhere, actually. Um... Because I know around here is, like, a street that does uh, Halloween stuff, and I'm not sure if they need, like, help doing things. So... That'd be kind of nice. If you want me in costume, I'll go in costume. That'd be fucking... That'd be kind of fun. <laughs> Nothing. Mom's birthday split year says you want to eat candy, fun time. No plans other than the usual Gregory Horror Show watch. That's pretty good, Scarf. I like that. It's a good ritual. Do you want to know what are you doing on November 1st? Discount candy day, yeah? You're doing a spooky corn maze next weekend? Yo. I haven't done corn mazes in fucking forever. I've done one, actually, uh, which I, I think is, like, above average, probably. Like, corn mazes aren't really a common thing, it seems like. Well, I guess I should consider myself lucky. I guess so. You trigger tree at 24 if it wasn't for the pandemic and your shitty health, to be honest. Yeah. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's do some virtual trick-or-treating. I don't know how that would work. Okay, here's the duck. Look. Look at these fucking ducks. That's a pen. For scale. These are so fucking cool. Honestly. They're really cool. I love them. I have to put them in a plastic bag so they don't get lost because they're so freaking tiny. There's a bigger one too that I think is on my other desk. So like the, uh, the parent duck. But those are the small ones. I love glass stuff. Like, I want a glass bowl at some point. So I can make shit like this. Like, glass sculptures? They're so freaking cool. I love them so much. Like, I can't imagine the skill to make something like this, you know, if it's by hand. It seems pretty nuts, because, like, all of this... I've seen, like, glass blowing, and it's, like, pretty intense. Aside from, like, you know, the risk of massive burns. <laughs> Kami-sama says there's games with a trick-or-treating focus. Yeah, Costume Quest. Yeah, Costume Quest is a good trick-or-treating game. Yeah. For sure. Glass blowing does look sexy. It does. There's a place near here where I could try it and, like, make a bowl or something. I'll have to do that at some point. That seems fun. Had Gary put in the golden bird. That bird really so heavy? Yeah, you're strong, dude. Well, at any rate, let's hurry and take a look inside. With how securely guarded this room was, there's sure to be something. Perhaps an exit. Perhaps a painting that's gonna try and like eat her ass. The college you went to back in Ontario had a glass blowing workshop and they always had the classic rock playing. That's how you knew. You were walking by it, just a classic rock. You had a bunch of Swarovski Quistel figs. Qu Quist Quistel? What is this accidental ooh speak I've been doing recently? What the fuck? <laughs> Crystal figs? My parents got rid of all of them? What the hell? Why? Why though? That sucks. Wait, what the fuck? Hold on. Cat boyfication in progress. Shut up. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Right now. Do not do it. Say no more. If you're tired, why not rest? You'll never suffer again. There's something sitting on the frame. Obtain the gray key. Ah, uh, another key. No exit for us this time. Eve? Something to matter? 
huh? The people in this painting are your mom and dad? Uh, not that you mention it, I can see the resemblance. But why would such a painting be down there, I wonder? Uh, where are they? <clears throat> well, I can't say I know either. D don't worry, they must be somewhere. I thought she was a tough kid, but it's surely getting to her after all. Aw. He cheer up, okay? I'm sure your mom and dad are somewhere. Aw. Oh, what the f- What was that sound just now? <laughs> Don't like that. Uh, yeah, bad idea, probably. <laughs> hold on, hold the fuck on. Oh. The door won't open. What? Are you kidding me? The door was wide open. Th that noise, is it coming from outside? This could be bad. Be careful, Eve. Uh, couch? This is no time to be sitting around! Oh shit! Oh, they're breaking in. Yeah, I'm out of here. See ya. <laughs> I'm out of here. Why are there so many mannequins? What's going on? I think we better get away from here and quick. Eve, look! See that locked door over there? That gray key we picked up should be able to open it. It has to. Let's make our way over. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh shit! Oh, okay, okay. Okay, we're just moving. <sighs> yeah, always in such inconvenient locations. We can take a shortcut if we go through these, all right? Let's go around. No, it's fine. We're going around. As promised, I will stop time briefly. Oh, thanks. Oh shit. Briefly, you say? <laughs> there we go. Oh, man. And paintings. Oh no. Oh jeez. Should be far enough, I think. We certainly show them. My, well then. Let's keep moving. Uh, Eve? You look pale. Are you okay? Oh no. Eve? Stay with me now. Eve! Eve! You can't find your red rose. Numbers. Uh... Fuck? Oh no. <laughs> no. 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 I need to, I need to like, code in some more emotions to myself here, because this game is certainly bringing out the best in me. Okay. 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 Yeah, yeah, um. Lots of mannequins. Their eyes are now bloodshot. Hmm. Who the fuck is that? God, who, who the fuck is that? Where 
Wherever you go, everyone's watching. <laughs> Content creator moment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hello? Eve, where are you? You better run quick or I'll catch up. Ah, uh, what do I do? I've searched everywhere, but I can't find her. That was my dad, right? Yeah. Okay, we're saving. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Well, I guess we're not. Okay. <laughs> All right. The ink, though, yeah. There's ink spilled all over, so you can't write it in anymore. Did you lose all the records you made? Want to go home soon. The original game's gray area was much scarier for being far less scripted and linear. Really? That seems like an area I have to play the original of. Because a lot of people are mentioning differences here. Be quiet in the gallery. You can't talk or you'll be found. The rose melted the moment you touched it. Lots of doors, 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 doors. M Mom? Where did that girl get to? She has to go off on her own and then this. What a bother. If she doesn't hurry, we won't be able to leave. Fuck you. Oh no. <laughs> the woman in the painting is smiling. The woman in the painting is smiling. The streamer in the bottom right corner is smiling. The woman in the painting is smiling. Yeah, she's they're giggling too, yeah. The woman in the painting is smiling. The woman in the painting is smiling. <laughs> the woman in the painting is smiling. Smiling is good for you, everyone. It helps raise your mood, arguably. You all want to smile for me? Just like I am? Just like these ladies in the game are? Yeah? Thank you. You are doing a great job. Hold on, let me, let me show more of you off. Hold on, let's see here. Oh, we have a non-smiler in chat. Uh-oh. Well, you know what we have to do now. <laughs> Ban! Kill! We got six. We got like we gotta like send one of these paintings to their like their place. <laughs> the woman in the painting is smiling. 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 Mother and father. Uh. The exit is ahead. Oh, really? Yeah. You sure about that? You! You fucker! Oh god. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wait, 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 don't, 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 don't. Ah.
Rise and shine, Eve. How do you feel? I had a nightmare. I see, you poor thing. I can't say I'm surprised. You've been put through such frightful things. Perhaps I should have woken you. I'm sorry. I didn't even notice. Eve, would you dig in the pocket of that coat? Oh, this song. Oh. It's a piece of candy. You can have that. Feel free to eat it. Now, let's rest here a little while longer before we set out again. Oh, that's right. I placed your roads in the vase there. Yeah, the, the sprite emotion things are really good. I did notice the subtle, like, like three pixel changes in the in the uh, the animations. You like Eve looking down? Yeah, I think Eve was like doing a pose when we like the f we we got through the room. Like she was like clutching her uh, her stomach because like she wasn't feeling good. Untitled. That looks like a streak of like random like just something. I don't know. Like a T, but splatters. In other places. Rules of the gallery. No loud conversation, no photography, no food or drink, no fountain pens. No leaving this place. Okay. For picking up his coat, why the fuck would I- <laughs> Come on. No fountain pens, fun time, sorry. You gotta leave your collection at home. Fun pictures. It's filled with lots of large drawings. There we go. Oh, my coat. How thoughtful of you, Eeb. Drip reacquired. The woman here. Likes to play loves me. Loves me not. That was one of the, um, the things earlier in the game, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, are you not going to eat the candy? Do you not like lemon flavor? Ah, uh, that's not it. Well, eat it whenever you wish. It's just a small piece of candy, but it may help you stay calm. I know it's a bit late to point it out, but this is actually the first time I've seen a blue rose. I've never seen one, not even at the forests. I wonder if these actually exist in real life. Eve, are you able to walk around? If you're tired, make sure to tell me right away, okay? Don't be shy about it. I'll completely understand. That painting there, it's titled, uh, Untitled. Is Untitled the title? Or is there no title making it untitled? Huh? I've lost you, haven't I? It's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, it was of Gary's Rose, yeah. Say, Eve, I bet your family's pretty well off, isn't it? I mean, your clothes. They may look simple, but they use some fine quality cloth, don't they? Hmm? Your mother just picks them out for you? Still, that just proves that your family is well off. And... I think that's it for the dialogue. This place, it must be connected to the Gerterna exhibit, don't you think? I wonder where all the other visitors to the gallery went. For all we know, there might be others who got lost in this place. If there are, I hope we can find each other. Uh, I'm a little thirsty. Do you think I could drink from this vase? <laughs> I'm only joking. Yeah, it looks like it's randomly selected, yeah. At a point. I was just so focused on getting out of here. I show no consideration. No regard for you. Sorry about that. Huh? What is it? What the fuck? Why do you talk like a lady? 
Sorry for troubling you. Stare intently or nothing. <laughs> like a lady. What a question. But, hmm. I can't quite remember. I just stuck to it, I suppose. But it's good to be gentle rather than rough, don't you agree? Trying to see if I can get the, uh, the other dialogue pieces. <sighs> I got up early today, so I'm feeling a bit sleepy now. I was so looking forward to going to a gallery after so long, and then this. Yeah, that choice probably makes more sense to Japanese, yeah. With the, uh, the... Not honorifics, but just the, uh, certain points of the- certain parts of the language. And how you use certain terms. The pronouns, yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I think I've had enough of art galleries at this point. And participles, yeah. Yeah. Atashi? Is that, is that it? Anna? Okay. Hmm? What am I reading? A book I found here with lots of words. Even the title is a bit long. I suppose it may have belonged to Gertena. It's so interesting. I was lost in thought. But it may be a bit too difficult for you, Eve. Eve, we might need to keep walking for a while after this. I know I might not be the most reliable person for such a situation. But if you find yourself thinking, I can't take it anymore, just tell me, okay? If need be, I can at least try to carry you on my shoulder. Say, Eve, how old are you? Nine. My, is that right? I figured you would have been older. But that's amazing, visiting a gallery at your age. If it were me, I'm certain I'd be bored. Instead of the trans- instead the translation tries to make him talk like an old lady. Yeah, it's very like, you know, descriptive the way he's talking. They did their best of Gary talking the way he does, even if the feminine thing doesn't really come across, though. So much of him just talking all proper. Yeah. I got more of the proper sense from Gary. Hmm? My coat's all torn and ragged? Oh, no, 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 that's on purpose. That's just how it's designed. Though, to be sure, it is getting a bit worn from many years of use. Stare intently. <laughs> huh? Um, Eve, did I do something wrong? You're scaring me a little. You know, I was debating this morning whether I should go out in something a bit a little more fancy. But now, I'm rather glad I chose to wear this. I do feel a bit out of place, though. Now that I think about it, you were walking around this place all by yourself until you found me. That's nothing to sneeze at, I mean it, that's brave. There is so much here. <laughs> Holy shit. I think I've gotten most of it at least. Gary's feeling a little sleepy, a little sleepy. Sorry for troubling you. Oh, why, there's nothing to apologize for. You didn't do anything wrong, Eep. I mean, no one could have predicted that things would end up like this. Come on, cheer up. It's a disservice to your adorable little face to look so dour. Alright. Well, I think that's a good place to stop for now. Uh, 59 out of 150, wow. We still have a lot to go, looks like. Damn. Uh, I'm not done yet, though. Um, because I do want to just do a bit more of something. Uh, just because I have the time. What a, what a game. Like, holy hell. 
<laughs> again, the game scared me again, which I wasn't expecting. And, uh, Gary is just... The best. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> like, like, holy shit. He cares, you know? He cares. Number one big brother figure, yeah, seriously. He just took to, like, you know, looking out for her. It's nice. We see him Gary, the candy. It has a nice lemony smell. We still have the lace handkerchief from our mom. That'll probably come into play at some point. Alright. Well, next Eve stream will be on, um... Wednesday, I think? Um... I think Wednesday, yeah. I think we'll do it on Wednesday. Just, But stay tuned uh, in Discord and on, on Twitter as, as usual. But for now, gonna switch gears a little bit. Uh, it's still gonna be cozy, uh, but in a different sense. Because uh, I'm gonna play some Rune Factory 4. Fuck it. <laughs> I'll do like a day or something. I'll, I'll show everyone what's been going off my farm. So, all right. Um, if you haven't seen Rune Factory, by the way, it is a farming game, uh, from the same makers of what was Harvest Moon, now Story of Seasons, um, and, uh, it's got a lot more combat, a lot more, you know, RPG focus, so it's cool, it's very cool, alright, um, Rune Factory, let me see here, you saw Limes played a few years back, really, I didn't know she played it, damn. What's up, Fat Jokes are Lane, by the way? How you doing? Okay, uh, title. Um. Should I make the title I fucked up and accidentally harvested giant carrots by accident? Because I definitely did that. <laughs> yeah, I, did, I, I fucking didn't know, guys. <laughs> they, they were like, it, it was like a, a square of like large carrots. And I was like, hmm, I wonder what's going on here. Um, and then I harvested it and it just became regular carrots. I didn't know I was supposed to just like wait for it to keep growing. So I, fu I, saw I fucked up really bad there. Real bad. <laughs> Farming, fighting, and dating. There we go. That's, that's a good title. I like that. That's a good title. Because you guys will start to uh, realize who I'm going for in this game probably in just a second. So let's boot this up. Uh, no ads. I don't do ads. I don't need a break. I'm all good. Um, let me just make sure my switch is plugged in. Let's see here. Uh, let me just get this here. The remake Fat Jokes Are Lame. I'm so excited for that game. It looks sick. I, I'm so excited for that. The remake of um, the uh, Story of Seasons. A Wonderful Life. Is that what it was? I think it was A Wonderful Life. Yeah. The one where you uh, actually... Um, where your kid actually like you know, does a significant deal in the game. Which is cool as fuck, honestly. I can't wait to experience that. Let me turn my fan on, too. One second. Can't kind of... There we go. We're just gonna do like 30 minutes of this, just like a day or something, just to uh, wind down. Uh, let me just... Uh... Say switching to a tiny bit. Rune Factory 4. In the meantime, since we have a break, um, ducks? You want ducks? I got ducks. Uh, let me see here. Where are my ducks? <laughs> oh, I guess it uploaded. Good. Okay, good. I got fresh ducks from today. All right, let me get some duck music going on here while I figure this out. There we go. Uh, duck music. Let's do Galaxy. Oh, good duck music. <laughs> oh, okay, this is good. This is good. So say hello to my friend. That's a friend too, but also I have this friend. You might have seen this friend before. Um, this is the, uh, the bright color duck I talk about. A lot. This duck is so funny. Like, it's it's like a, I think a domestic breed with like a mallard, like a cross. Um, 
This duck will like walk around. Like if I if I show up, he'll like she'll just like walk with me, but like from a distance, like six feet away. So socially distancing. It's really cute. <laughs> I did feed the ducks today too. So let me see if we can get a picture of that. She's very pretty, yeah. That is not what I wanted, game. Or photos. So here we go. <laughs> it's the chaos. The absolute chaos when I uh, scatter down the seed. <laughs> I was to make sure I, I like spread it out actually a little bit. The uh, the duck seed, because they will start like bullying each other to try and get the food. Give another a good one. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is good. This guy is an absolute loafer. Oh, it's kind of dark. Hold on. I gotta touch up these foes at some point, but... Look at this loaf. <laughs> Mega loaf. Here, let me uh, break this up. Oh, that's a little too bright. Sorry. Sorry about that. That's better. There we go. Look at him. Just loafing around. I love him. <laughs> Just loafing around. There's actually, like, for some reason, they have, like, um. They might have, like, hired some company to, like, try and drive the geese away from the, uh. The little beach that they have here. For some reason, like, because they have, like, dogs just, like, chasing them off. And I'm like... Sorry about that. What the hell is that? <laughs> I'm just like, no! Don't don't chase them off. Let them fucking fly free. What the hell? Like, yeah, seriously. My uh, capture card's fucking up a bit. One second. Let's see what's going on with that. Are you okay, capture card? I don't think you're okay. One second. Something's wrong here. Maybe my capture card's finally fucking tight. <laughs> Who knows? I know the cables are good. Just replace the cables with like fresh cables. That's plugged off. There we go. Right. A uh, swear jar is gone, Squeaker, because I, I didn't want it uh, on during Eve. That's why. That's the only reason. For those atmospheric games, I tend to cut down on the sound effects a little bit. This is not working. Uh, okay, I need to figure this out. One second. This is not working. This goes out at a some point. Up. This guy now gets plugged to my PC. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna use a different USB port. Lucky for me, I know how to text the port, so don't you worry, chat, we'll get this figured out. Don't you worry. Alright. You know what I had today? I had like this thumb. I'm gonna bring my mic with me while I go under the, uh, the counter here. So I had this, uh... In, like, Pike Place Market, there's a place called Piroshki Piroshki. Um, I think it's, like, Russian. Like, it's, like, a Russian bakery. Super popular place. They have, like, the best pastries around in town. They've got, like, a salmon pastry. They have, um, marzipans. Uh, they have, like, a pumpkin spice one. 
that I'm gonna try later tonight. That sounds pretty good. Uh, that's the cable. Okay. Not pierogies. Piroshki. Piroshki, piroshki. P I R O S H K Y, I I think? That's how you spell it, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. Okay, let me try this port. There we go. Yeah, Limits had that. Because he was in Seattle for a bit. Ooh. You've never had a pumpkin spice coffee? I've never had a i I've never had a pumpkin spice anything, really. It's uh it's not really been within my wheelhouse, so to speak. Oh no. The other port's not working. Are you kidding me? Okay, one more try here. Because Oh, it's working! Oh shit, okay, here we go. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. It's a meme, but it's good, Professor Pineapple. Yeah. It, it is very good, pumpkin spice stuff. Yeah, there we go. Okay, good, good. There we go. All right. Um, I was doing something with the audio to get it to not delay, because it delays if I with my current setup a little bit. Um, but hopefully, like, it's, it's fucking Rune Factory. It's fine. <laughs> I think it's okay. This is like a weird mixing thing I have to do. All right. It's gonna be like a few milliseconds delay. Just don't worry about it. Uh, let me just restart the game here. Cause I think it's fine. Yeah. There we go.